Hey folks, I'm Vixen today we are going to play a bit more of Oriental Empires by Shining Pixel Studios and in the last episode we are back to war with the Bao, we are also at war with the zoo and we are about to take Yi Cheng before maybe uh, trying to make peace with the Bao I don't know, I'm always dragged to war by the Queen my allies and I'm not sure I want to be at war with the South anymore it seems to be weaker and weaker and I don't want to expand too much in this direction. I need to be careful with Azuzo though, because it seems to be a bit stronger. Anyway, we've got Kicheng, which is uh, going to be taken soon, hopefully. We've got also a bunch of armies, which are just roaming our territory and burning our farms. They are not very dangerous, but we need to take care of them if we want to take, um, to take our land back, kind of. And we'll see what's going to happen then. I will probably try to go back to peace if I can, but... Uh, maybe it's not going to be possible. We'll see. Anyway, let's go back. So we've got Yi Cheng here, which is going to have only two bodyguards. I believe it might be uh, their leader, so it might uh, end the faction or something like that. And we've got the Zhu here, which are actually uh, sieging the castle as well. So let's see if I can just speed up things. Because I've got a decent army over there. So they've got uh, two units of spearmen, I've got much more uh, units, but I do not have so much uh, bowmans, so I need to be careful. We are going to try to maybe attack this thing. Alright, let's see. Let's see how it's going to happen. Alright. So it might be flanked, but... I'll just speed up a bit. We've got a few battles. Wait, just not so fast. What's going on here? This is my army. Where are they going? I forgot. I think they might have fought the, um, the little armies of, of the bar over there. So they are not in our... Uh, yeah, they are still a bit in our territory, but not too much. So it's a bit better. We've got still one uh, near uh, Seika and another one near Chengdu, but I don't think it's going to be so much trouble. Okay, let's see. Let's speed up a bit. I'm pretty sure my army is not going to be able to break through the walls of Yi Cheng yet. Still, they've got very little thing to arm us. Uh, let's take a look. We've got a bit of trouble with our harvest. No, it's good. It's very, very good, my mistake. Um, Let's go back. We need to check a few things that I did not uh, pay attention to the unrest uh, recently. So let's just take a look. This seems to be uh, kind of fine. I'm going to ask them to uh, make a bunch more uh, extra farms. Zedong is uh, barely holding it. What's going on here? Oh, too much people. So I need to keep... Um, keep making money so I can expand this city, but I'm not making much each turn. I'm making some, but not enough. So this is why I want to go back to peace, so I can make more money and try to expand my cities. Uh, let's see. Jiameng is fine. Mianzu is kind of fine, but still crowded. We need to do something about this. I need 2000 per town, it's not going to be cheap. And I also need to uh, get to the next uh, age, kind of. So you guys, pretty fine. Let's just take a look. Uh, can I do more farms? No, it's fine. We are still lacking food. Yes, we are. And the unrest is quite low, which is cool. And Chengdu here. Uh, let's take a look. We've got 37 persons unrest. And most of it is because of the labor service. So when I'm going to stop making farms, it's going to get better. Still haven't got a bit to do. And we are lacking plenty of food. So we need to do a bunch. Alright. And we are back to Z. Okay, so Z is fine. We just need to build more farms, that's all. And we'll be fine. We are going to be able to trade a bit of food between cities. If they are not breaking our trade routes, which I might uh, want to pay attention to, because it was the case, I think, in the last episode. They were just blocking our routes. And it was quite an issue. Oh, these are not blocked. Good. And these two. Okay, it was over there. They were blocking this trade route. It was uh, doing a lot of harm to our cities. Because this city is not... Yes, this is the issue. I need to uh, make maybe another trade route. So I can... Um, maybe I'm lacking a town over there. I could try to do an extra town here. 
and it could allow us to make a uh, full circle here and not be uh, in trouble anymore. Uh, it might be possible, I think I can do that, um, probably. Let's take a look. Uh, let's see in Chengdu if I was to uh, make one more uh, unit of settler. It's going to cost me 500, but it might be uh, worth it. And we're going to put it just over there, next to their city. It's going to make a link, we'll just add a bunch of roads, and it will be better. Let's just do that this way. Meanwhile, uh, where is my settler? I f always forget that I'm getting these right away. I don't need to wait, which is cool. Uh, so we're going to bring city over there. Do I want to... Maybe it's going to be a good uh, point. Maybe make a bunch of arbor and, and try to trade a bit. It's going to be uh, quite a decent place. Plus there is a bunch of things around which might be useful. Oh, my mistake. I forgot. It, this is not a um, resource. It is where I can establish my town. So I don't have so much choice. I need to put it here. It's far from perfect. But it is possible to do so. I might want to do it anyway. Uh, and it's going to protect the Chengdu a bit. Which might be useful. Still it's going to be very close to, to these three cities. But when we're, when we're going to be at peace I will be able to trade wer very well with these. Yes, yeah, so we're going to do that. Or there. Maybe here it's better. Okay, so let's take a look. Uh, we've got nothing which is happening in these. There is no enemy uh, ready to attack us. I do not have any noble units ready, but I will have some in nine turns. All right, and I cannot, uh, I cannot take Yicheng yet. Do I want to obliterate the zoo? It would just give us something to do here. I could just uh, stop and wait, but they are going to. Uh, Let's move our troops over there. And we'll just rotate them when it is going to be the right time. Can I do it? Maybe now and... Okay, that way it's better. Alright. Now we need to bring more units. I need more bombers. So do we have a battle somewhere? Yes, we do have a battle here. So I've got Axemen which are fighting the Spearmans, which should end well. Long Spearmans against uh, Long Spearmans, okay. What are my Axemen doing? Oh, these are more Spearmans, <laughs> okay. Uh, I forgot, we've got two units of Axemen, I think, with two units of Long Spearmen. So it should be more than sufficient to defeat these guys. And what's happening here? I think my Axemen are just pursuing them. They are going to end up dead at some point. But it's keeping me busy, it would be better just uh, sending my units um, to Yicheng to speed up things. Okay, winter. These guys are bothersome, there is only one of these chariots. Let's take a look. Can I get a better view? No, oh, there is three. Okay. So if, if I had cavalry, I could just uh, try to catch them. But I don't think I've got any yet. I've got a granary which has been built in, in Z. I've got a farm in Jiameng and Landit's village in Zitang. And in Yicheng as well. But I, I have the one building the thing, so it's all good here. Oh! Oh! Not good. Uh, not too bad, but not that good either. Uh, we've got five units of light spearmen which are coming from the zoo. So they're going to attack Zitong maybe. So what I might want to do is to actually uh, bolster my defense a bit. So we are going to... Uh, I think I can get two of these. So I'm going to try to go for one unit of omens and one unit of uh, axemen. I think these are going to be much stronger than their units, so we should be fine. Still, I need to challenge a few things. So my units of omens are going to remain uh, at a distance. Uh, we're going to go with Harass here. And my units of uh, Axemen I think are alright. We've got a bunch of extra armor here so it is good. I will need to add a bunch of walls on this city because it is just too easy to take them if you don't have walls. I could do it right away. It can take a few turns though. It's going to cost me... Oh, it's not that expensive. Going to boost happiness. Uh, okay, let's go for it. 
Zidong is too exposed with the zoo which are attacking us. It is one of the city of the north, so. Mianzu uh, is quite safe with these two queen cities around. But Zidong, and it might be dangerous to keep it that way. I've got already a wall on Seika. I've got another one in Chengdu, I think. Do I? Why is it Chengdu? Oh, just over there. I've got one in Chengdu. It's quite a big city now. And I've got a, a huge one on Z. This is why I wanted to take this city so bad, because they've got a pretty amazing wall. It's a city which is going to be fairly easy to defend with this. Even though they might pillage our land, they might uh, wait a bit to enter this town. Okay, let's take a look. I've got a bunch of things which are not running well. I've got a bit of unrest in, in Seika. No, it seems to be fine. We've got trouble incoming, but... Kind of fine. Let's just take a look in Chengdu. Chengdu is at 48. It's not increasing so much, I believe. So, food shortage. There might be a unit which is um, blocking our uh, trade routes. I need to check that. And Zitong is also a little bit in trouble. And okay. Seems to be kind of fine. You know what? I might want to produce a bunch more of extra units in Seika and send them to reinforce Zitong. It might be uh, a good way to deal with these units. Uh, I've got a bunch of uh, noble axemen which are ready to come and fight. So I'm going to take these two extra units and can I bring them in time? Uh, which one do I want to send? Maybe the weakest one. So I keep the best one in take, yeah. Yes, it's working. Okay, let's do that this way. And they are not that dangerous now that we've got many units to see them coming. Do I want to go and obliterate these guys because we are not going to enter yet, so it might be better to remove these before they get reinforced. Okay, let's go that way. So we'll be the only one to be able to get uh, Yi Cheng. Let's take a look at what's happening in Zitong as well. Yep, here they come. And they've got a large force here. Hopefully we'll manage to uh, fend them off. But there, there are many enemies here. I'm a bit worried, I must say. Uh, are my troops? Yes, they are incoming. It was a good move to bring them here. It's going to reduce a bit their ability to to get us. But they are going to attack south and I'm not sure there is much defense here. Let's bit a bit. Oh, hey there. I've got a few units which are fleeing. It seems to be alright. I've got a bunch of units which are going to flank them here. And my bowmen should be shooting a bit when they can. Alright, let's see. Okay, they are fleeing. We should have a wall in a few turns, so we should be a little bit better. Oh, I've got you. What's going on here? Oh, this unit is not useful anymore because I should have just sent it uh, to the fight. There is no more buy ins here, so this unit is free to go wherever she wants. Okay, so these guys are arriving in Zitong. It should be a slightly bit better. Uh, our finance are low, I know. But I'm going to remove two units here because these are not going to be uh, too reliable. We are going to disband these two. And it should help a bit with our money. Not enough, maybe, but still. And these two units, I don't really need these to um, reinforce Yi Cheng, do I? I wonder. I'm going to send them back to Z. Yes. And um, maybe I could just disband a few units somewhere so I can recover a bit of uh, financial stability. There's many. Oh, not so many. The moral is high, though. And let's see. I've got a unit which is uh, low in efficiency. I need to uh, maybe stop uh, doing things with it. Yeah, I'm just going to pick these guys up and I'm going to send them to pillage a bunch of farmland. I'm going to rest them a bit. They might turn on me though. 
Okay, let's see. I've got a bunch of units around Sega. Is this still the same? No, it's not. Uh, we've got... Oh, okay, these did not move too much. They so are just uh, pledging our land. So maybe the best move I could do is to send units to remove them from this location. So they stop plundering our land. And I'm going to do the same here. Alright. And this unit, is it moving? Yes, it's moving back to Z, so all is, all is fine. I've got a unit over there, which is uh, going to establish a down soon. So all good. And let's just see what's going to happen. Do I need to go for any kind of uh, research here? We are going to be uh, soon unable to research anything else. I need to hurry. I'm lagging a bit behind, I believe. And uh, let's just go for it. Okay, there is a bit of uh, random here. We need to pay attention to things. We've got a battle in Seika, which is going to be... It's finished already. We've got a second battle in Chengdu, which is uh, kind of uh, happening. Not a very dangerous one, it seems. Plus we've got reinforcement in, in town. And we've got a bigger battle here, with the, the zoo which are trying to enter Yi Cheng, but which are flanked by my units. So they're going to probably be in a bad shape. If we were to deplete them, it would be better. Oh, they are flying. Come on, guys. Okay, they are flying a bit further. I'm not going to remain here. I don't want to be attacked by, by this guy from the back. Let's just uh, see. So we are not losing so much money yet. I'm going to send these units back here. We are going to rotate them a bit. Nope, wrong direction. Here we go. And this unit is going to remain here and rest a bit while we are pledging the lands. Um, let's see. Maybe there is one unit I can remove somewhere. Maybe in Zitong here. But a unit which is going to be a bit less efficient, like this guy here. I could remove him. And. Done. Plus 20. It's not that good, but going to allow us to accumulate a bit of wealth uh, over time. Okay, these guys are done with that, so let's just send them back in. Should be the same in Chengdu. Nope, we've got still a bunch of... of shirt over there. How many? I don't want to see the battle, I want to see the... Num okay, there is three now. They had four before, I think. So I'm just going to send another unit. Seems not to be very good. I think my units retreated. So... Far from being... We're well, going to send two units this time. We'll see what's going to happen. And this unit uh, is my... Yes. Okay, so let's just try to uh, make a new city here. So the city of Yuoyang. And now... Let's see what I can do with it. I do not have so much money. I'm a bit worried that I'm going to lose it. It was a mistake. I've got no army to project it. Uh, let's see what I can do here. Alright, so... I'm not going to build any wall if I want to retake it, I want to be able to do it quickly. Uh, I'm just going to build farm, I think. It might be the best thing I can do. For now. With a bit of luck, they are not going to attack it because they've got no army around. Uh, maybe they've got one in Pingdu, though. Okay, maybe it was a bad move. <laughs> Still, it's going to allow me to uh, do a bit more trading over there. So the route is not going to be blocked if they are going around. So not so bad. Still, we'll need to protect it. And it's going to cost me a bit. Um, this unit is going back to Seika. Do I want to send it to Chang to Wu Yang? I'm not sure. It seems to be a bit far. It would be better just to send it back to Seika and send somebody from Chengdu to protect the city. Not Bowman's because I've got uh, no walls. We'll see. Oh, we've got a research which is done. Just uh, go for another one, so I can get a bit more, maybe, culture. Do we have any which is remaining? Yeah, it's this one. It's going to increase our ability to trade, which is good. It's going to give us more money. Alright, so do we have a wall already in Zitong? I need to check that. Uh, let's see. How many turns? One turn, okay. So maybe I would be able to reduce a bit the amount of soldier in Zetong if I got the wall to protect us. 
Okay, we've got to battle in Chengdu. It might be a small one. Yes, it is. Nice. This is a perfect way to... Ah, oh, come on, they are fling again. They are fling so fast. But they lost a lot of people, I think. And they might not return for a bit. Alright, so we might retrieve a bit of money out of it. We need to repair our farm though. Okay, we've got a bit of uh, trouble in a few towns. I need to, to go and check it out. We've got a bit of trouble in, in Seika. Oh, not so much. Uh, what's going on with Seika? Uh, we've got... No, 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 it's not trouble. We've got just a little unit over there. Which is uh, willing to... Uh, I might want to go from one more farm or two. So we are really short in food here. It's uh, increasing a bit too much. We've got troops over there. Yes, we do. But now we've got a wall, so it's going to be a little bit more difficult to, to fight us. Yep. And what do they have? Only light spearmen, so these guys might turn on them. Still is going to burn my farm for a while, which is going to enter my economy. Uh, let's take a look. I'm lacking in it here, but I don't want to hire more. So we're just going to remain in some of this, in this situation for now. I'm going to send these units so done. Okay. Um, I might want to go for more trading here. Uh, I could go for... Um, Maybe a pottery workshop, or I could just save money for a bigger market. Uh, it's not that expensive. If I do that, I might just gain more money. Uh, I need to just help us in our war. We might want to do that. Uh, still, I've got a few things to do also in Wuyang. But I don't want to uh, expand too much until I know if I'm going to retain this city or not. Let's take a look. I've got seven um, settlement and ten in authority, so I'm fine. There is not so much trouble which is going to happen yet. We're going to get another one with Yicheng, but I do not intend to expand much more. Okay, these guys are back. <laughs> uh, this city is never going to fall if I'm not doing anything. I need to send more more bombers here. Uh, do we have any remaining somewhere? Yes, but there are quite four. And from Chengdu, maybe. I've got plenty of uh, bowmen to Chengdu. I think it might be the only solution here. So, I could do a few more. These are noble archers. So are, they should be better. I could recruit a bunch, but it's going to cost me uh, a little bit of money I'm getting. Okay, we're going to try to speed up this thing. I'm going to recruit two units. We are going to send them right away. Uh, do I want to send two or three units? I've got two axemen. I'm going to send three units of Bowmans. Let's just uh, change the, um, the way they're going to react. We're going to go in Arras. And we're going to uh, send our three best units, uh, which are going to be this one, this one, and this one. Yep. And these three units are going to join us in Yicheng as quickly as possible. Oh, come on, it's going to take so much time. Uh, it's better than nothing, so we'll go with that. All right, uh, let's call it a down. Hopefully I've got a road. <laughs> Maybe I don't have a road between Zitong and Z. It's definitely possible. I need to check on that. This seems to be some kind of road though. Maybe they didn't finish it. It's quite possible. Do we have a battle somewhere? No, it seems to be fine. But Zitong seems to be in trouble. Oh, yes it is. What's going on? Oh, food shortage is quite uh, high. Uh, too much work. Okay, I'm going to lose this time if I'm not careful. Let's just remove all these. So in Sweden we'll be a bit more stable here. I need to... Um, maybe add more units to uh, suppress a bit more. 22, it's uh, quite high. Already. 
is a road which is cut down by these guys? No, but the siege might be trouble. Do I want to break their siege? They've got only four units, but I don't want to remove too many units. I cannot send much more from the Seika. Maybe I could send a bench from Z. Z is quite stable, I think. 51. Not that stable. Ah. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, only thing I know is, is that I need to take Keychain quickly. And that I've got no way to do it. Seemingly. Um, let's just send this guy a bit closer. So we can maybe attack the south gate as well. They've been recovering a bit, so it's good. Uh, let's see. I do think I've got too many units in Yicheng, but if they were to decide to come from... Oh, Pinglu is under siege by a very little unit. <laughs> That's not going to help them much. Uh, okay, let's just see what's going to happen. I cannot really uh, move too much. I will take back Zitong if it is necessary, but I would prefer not to. I have to take it back. So where is the battle here? Okay, there is a siege of, of Yicheng, which is... Still happening. My woman should be shooting there, guys. I should have done that earlier. Even though I don't have much bowmans, it's still better than nothing. I just speed up a bit. Okay, it's done already. You could shoot a bit more. Come on, guys. We're not going to win that. Uh, how many units did... We did lose one unit and lose zero? Okay, it's not good. I need more bombers here. Let's see. Uh, is still Zitong in, in trouble? Yes, but a little bit less because uh, we've got more troops around. So I might want to keep the bombers for a bit just to see if it's going to enable us to survive a bit longer. Got three of these. I just bring them here, and maybe we'll send. Uh, how many units do they have? Four units. I could send four units to. Oh wait, a sec. I'm not pressing right. Okay, good. So I could send four units to take care of these guys, so they stop being on my territory. I'm going to send one unit to fend off the guy over there as well. So they stop. Uh, preventing us from making money. Uh, how many units do we have in this troop as well? One. So I might be able to end these guys. I'm going to take one of these units and just send it to do the, the walk here. I hope we're not going to be in trouble with that. I I will just uh, try to go a bit further. So let's just uh, see what's going to happen here. I think I might want to actually go for a little bit more uh, let's see what we got. Now I've got a few turns to wait for that. I think one, uh, no, not one, 16 turns. It's quite a bit. But we're going to be able to complete the, the last uh, research on the right in four turns, so it should help a bit. Alright, here we go. We've got plenty of battle running here. We've got uh, little ones around the, the main cities. Got a big one in the town. I might want to check this one. Uh, where is it? Over there. So we are going to surround these guys, and hopefully we are not surrounding them. They are surrounding us. Yet these units are not uh, exceptionally good, so they are going to probably flee before we do. And they should just leave our territory. Good, good for us. They might have lost a bunch of units uh, as well. So maybe they're not going to be as strong as they were. Alright. Is the city better? Seems to be the case. Seems to like it better when there is no foreign troops uh, burning the fields around the city. This is... Oh! Of course! Of course they did that. Ah! It was a mistake to do that, I, I knew it, but 
I did it anyway. <laughs> Let's just... Um, we'll take it back, it's not going to be very complicated. It is, it is a very uh, small town with no walls. The worst thing which could happen is that they're going to uh, upgrade it with their money and I will take it back then. It might be good for us. Uh, anyway. Two units, not too much. Um, let's see, can I ask them to boost Jack the city, please? And I'm going to send the, the units from Zetong, the Bowmans. Uh, which one? Uh, let's go for... These two seem, these two seem to be much uh, stronger. They have less, less defense, but they are stronger. So I'm going to send these... Uh, all right, so many turns. Let's send these units back to their respective city. All right. And too many towns, <laughs> too many enemy towns down there. Okay, the siege of Yiching is happening right now. It's not going to do much because they are just staying hidden and they're not going to exit, which is the wisest choice yet, which is a bit of trouble for us, so we're going to probably not lose so much units. These doors are open, just get in. Okay, nothing happened. Hope with more. Oh, what's going on here? So we trust you have, uh, you have honor and will support us uh, as our agreement demands. Will you honor our lands and declare war on these people who have gone to war with your ally? So why T? I don't even know these guys. I can declare war, but I don't know where they are. I hope they are not too too strong. I've been declaring war with many guys, but I don't even know where they are. And I don't even know them. I think I declare war on the Chang and, and the YD now. So these guys might be uh, rebels though. We'll see. So they might disappear before I, I, I get to meet them. Oh, what's going on here? We've got uh, units which are coming for each of the capital city of my... Uh, it's, it's, it's not good. Do I want to send reinforcement from jamming? It's probably a bad idea. No, nah, I'm not going to do it. Uh, I could send two units, but is it going to be enough? I don't know. It might. They don't have so much. What if I send one unit from Nanzu and uh, two units from Jiameng? It might be better. These are not too far. I could also... I'm going to send two units. And if I need to, I will just build extra units from this city. It's been a while since I've been creating some, so it might be fine. Alright. And just one little unit from Mianzu. How many can I create? Uh, two units in a very little time. Okay, good. Pretty much the same in jamming, I believe. Yep, pretty much the same. Okay, good. So, if I need to, I can get some units very, very quickly. The units are full of... of okay. Not very good units, but still quite a bit. Ah, uh, come on. I need Yi Cheng. I don't know why, but I need it. <laughs> it seems to be quite a good city. It's well protected with mountain. I like it. And we've got more zoo incoming. So I was, it was a good idea to just send a few reinforcements. I don't want them to lose their capital. It would just create a hole in my defense. I don't know why they are just fleeing with these units. Maybe there is more important job to do around here, but it might be important to keep the capital as well. I believe those who do not have so much uh, ways to take the capital though, so if there is a bunch of good walls, 
which might be the case. They might not be able to uh, take it. So these units are going to go and fight these guys. It should be sufficient to, if not fend them off, just weaken them a bit. Okay, Zedong is still at fight with these guys. I'm, I just want to finish them off so they don't uh, bother us anymore. We've got two units of spearmen. I'm going to send three units of axemen. It should be sufficient. Come on, guys, just finish them off. Uh, meanwhile, my bowmen are three turns uh, away from Yi Chang. Hopefully, with three more units of, of bowmen, I should be able to uh, send enough arrows flying this guy to kill these 36. Uh, Bodyguards. Oh, it seems they are putting units in Wuyang. They don't want to. Uh, let me take it back. Nope, and what's. I think the trouble in, in Zedong is just going to be resolved with the battle. I just want to make a quick check. Uh, 66. Uh, still full shortage. Um, 39, uh, 41, it's not that good. 5% Sega is good. <laughs> Chengdu, okay, I really need to do something. I think food shortage is going to be happening quite a bit. It is winter, so it might be why. But I need more granaries and stuff. Okay, so Battle of Yi Chang is going on. We've got the Battle of Yi Chui, which is happening. We're going to fight the Izu here. And they've got more units coming. This is why we need to deplete them quickly. Okay, we are basically even. There is uh, the same number of troops on the field. And we are losing. Oh no, we are... Yes, we are losing. We are going to bail. I think I might want to recruit more units and send them. There is many other units which I can drive, and it's not good for a lie. Okay, I lost this one. And still not moving in Yijang, it's, it's <laughs> a bit annoying. Now we've got the Battle of the Tongue, which is happening. And this one we won. Good. Oh, look at that. Uh, uh, there is even the, the leader. I, I didn't uh, spot it before. Not yet, I want to see the other one. Alright, let's see. So, are we still finding 60 persons? Yeah, the food shortage is still important. Let's send our units back. We've got too many front line. Uh, this is not good. Let's just uh, gather our troops over there. Nope, we cannot. Let's just gather them behind the citadel here. We are going to... Um, going to end a bit our economy, but we are going to go and send a few more recruits, uh, a few more axemen here. I've got two here, and we are going to send two more. I could go for a bunch of bombings as well. Just one unit to go for. Okay. Wait a sec. Uh, so I'm going to keep... I'll just take the best one. We're going to keep one unit over there. Let's just uh, gather our troops at the same point here. We're going to send... Uh, a few more. Uh, so we're going to go for a good bowman. I could just keep... I'm going to take the other one, which I'm going to uh, change. Uh, all right, like that. So these two, you go and meet with these guys. Uh, can you go further? Nope. So we're just going to come here. And these two, yes, taking here. Good, because we've got quite a bit of units over there. I don't want to uh, let my people get slaughtered. Okay, it should be fine. Oh, so many units. And the bar sending reinforcement. So are coming to Z with spearmen. We've got many units, so we should be fine. But we still need to be careful. 
Do I want to bolster our defense? I might want to go for a bunch of extra bowmen, but I don't think I can do these. I would have done that before. No, I cannot. So if I need to, I will recruit a few more axemen and just send them to slaughter them, but for now it will be that way. Alright. Uh, so Siege of Yicheng, we do not have any interest with that because it's never, nothing is going to happen. Uh, we've got... Oh, the Siege of Yichu, it's a bit more interesting. Do they have Bowmans? Oh, it seems uh, the Queen have a bit more units than before. No, they don't? Where are they? Are they counting our units? Uh, they are probably counting our units. It seems bad. I've <laughs> got only one unit which is coming towards them. We are lucky because these units they've got are not too tough. Yet, it's uh, tough enough. And there are too many. <laughs> we are still winning, but I think I'm going to take the heat of the battle, mostly. I don't think the, the Queen are going to participate too much. We are just giving them more time. Oh, they do have a few more units. Noble Cavalry and Light Archer. We'll see. I'm just going to uh, keep going like that. And we'll see what's going to happen. So, let's just keep going. Alright. And we'll see. Okay, so... Um, my bowman should be there in the next turn, so we should be able to do a bit of damage. I've got many units which are um, gathering to take uh, Z back. They've got no bowmen, they've got mostly... Uh, okay, I might want to just send a few more units to take care of them. Oh, look at the, at the money here, it's not good. Okay, so we are going to go and... Let's see... I think maybe with three units I could be able to actually uh, fend them off. Just need to take the best one. So these guys should be the one. Maybe one which is going to be doing a lot of damage. We're going to send them, take care of them. And meanwhile, let's take a look. So what's going on with uh, each? We are... Oh, it seems to be doable. We're going to get our units over there. And these units here are going to be gathered uh, over there. Okay. I've got a lot of money which is going to... Um, disappear with this but if we manage to um, weaken them enough we might want to let um, the queen just deal with it while i'm dealing with other things which are more important on my territory because look at that they're just recovering quite a bit look at all these units they've, they've gathered uh, it seems to be bad <laughs> okay how oh, are my town doing Uh, fine enough. We'll just keep going with the battles. Uh, all right. Okay. Now let's take a look. We've got uh, the Battle of Z, which should be kind of fine, even though it seems to be bad, because I've got one many units which is just in the heat of battle here, and they are trying to flank it not that good but they are fling so all fine they are out of it, our territory let's just take a look here in each way we are probably winning for now We've got a bunch of units on the field even though it seems the queen are going to bail soon yes they are bailing heavy spearmen they should not they are probably a bit uh, further by units Okay, let's take a look now with uh, Yi Cheng. Our bowmen should be arriving soon. Oh, they took a bit of damage, which is good. Now that we're going to be able to deplete them over time. Uh, I'm a bit worried about these guys, because if they were to attack my bowmen, it would be trouble. Okay, I believe we should be able to take maybe Yi Cheng in two turns now. They've been uh, quite a bit of trouble here. But we need to pay attention to other front line as well. So let's just uh, gather my troops. Uh, maybe not. 
But yeah, what I want to do is to keep these guys over there. Do not move. And we're going to bring a bunch of Bowmans with them. I could also bring maybe a bunch... Uh, let's see, if I was to bring one more of these guys over there. It might be better to have two troops over there and just let them attack on each side. Yes, uh, let's see. Um, things are going to attack by themselves. Don't really need to tell them to do so. Yet... I will. <laughs> okay. Uh, and this in Okay, good. They might want to rotate a bit as well. Nope. Nope. It's just fine. It's fine that way. So, this battle is done. Let's just bring them back here. Uh, this battle is not done. But we're going to send uh, fresh troops. Uh, maybe these uh, two. To deal with them again. And let's take a look at this front line, which is a bit more uh, feeble. So we're going to send these troops uh, to burn together with these. So it's going to be a bit uh, easier to uh, keep the front line uh, strong. Alright. Let's see. So the Siege of Yichen should just be uh, fine. Oh, why do they have so much units? Oh, the Zua. Uh, bending with the uh, with the bad two fighters a bit. Yet my woman should be fleeing, so we should be fine. Okay, so how much units do we have? No, not this each. This one. They still have 26 units, but if those are not in the way anymore, we should be able to shoot a bit and decrease this number. Oh, nice. Are we going to do a bit more than that? I'm not sure. Yet, uh, it might. Okay, it's happening a bit. We've got 12 uh, more units to take care of. Maybe it's going to take us 3 turns. It's definitely possible. Uh, let's go back to Zitong. Zitong should be uh, doing fine. Oh, not that fine. We've got units from uh, Z which are attacking Zitong. Ah, it should be fine. Uh, let's just go back to... Uh, where is... Oh, we are lacking one because it's probably over. Okay, it seems fine. Uh, they are not progressing so much. It's going to take some time to my vessels to actually strengthen the force here and keep their capital. Let's go back. So, how is this battle? This unexpected battle happening here? Oh, it seems they are fleeing here, so it's good for us. But, oh, okay, fine. Alright, let's see, so let's just send these units back. Where are they? They don't know where to go, it seems. Um, I've got all my units here, let's just uh, rotate them and make them advance. So we can take on these guys, we've got one noble shire unit and one, okay, we are just going to advance here. And fend them off. Oh, Yi Cheng has been captured. Oh, nice. Perfect. I just send my units in, so we're going to be able to routine the town. And let's see, there is a bit of disease in the Zhu city. We've got new farms in Seika and Jiameng. And the Battle of Zitong. And Yi Cheng and Yi Shui seems to be uh, fine. So now I'm just going to require uh, to recover the city of Wuyang. And when it's going to be done, we'll just try to go for peace. This city is going to be relatively easy to take because they've got no walls. What is they had no walls? Maybe they are now. It's not certain. So I'm going to let my units just rest a bit. I might want to go and... Oh, it's not the right city. It's not the right city. <laughs> my mistake. So I don't need that many units to protect Yi Cheng. I've got three units of bowmen and one unit of... Um, of Axemen. It might be sufficient for now as they've got good walls. So maybe I, what, what I want to do is to send these units... No, they are too existed. Uh, I'm going to send... We are just going to wait one turn and then I will send units to take uh, Wuyang back. I could try to... No, there is too many walls here. If I've got enough Bowmen, I could actually just take Jianzu and Wuyang at the same time. It might just... Um, put a stop to their uh, progression. 
It's definitely possible. I don't think these guys are trouble, they've got only one unit here, so I don't really need to worry too much. Nope, it seems to be relatively uh, feeble around. Uh, let's take a look. Uh, what if I was to ask for peace in exchange for Yu Yang? Let's take a look. It might just uh, speed up a bit the process. Uh, request audience here. So we're going to go for a peace agreement here. Uh, choice of 20 turns. Okay. And in exchange, I want you to give, my, to give me back Wu Yang. Uh, do you agree to that? I don't think they will, but... Nah, they don't. Nah, it was worth trying. Then I will take it back. Not going to be too difficult to have speed up this thing a bit, but... We'll do without. I'm burning too much money. I'm burning really too much money. Uh, I need to remove a bunch of units uh, of active duty. Maybe in Chengdu. Can they actually uh, build Bowmans? Yes, they can. So I'm going to remove one of these units. It's not going to decrease much uh, the amount of money I'm bleeding, but a little bit is not too bad. I cannot really remove much more units anywhere. I need these. Maybe in Z, I could remove one unit. But I could also just keep it and send it to to Yan. How many units do we have here? Uh, three noble child, which are quite dangerous, and two light spearmen. I think I need at least four units of of, of five units of Axemen to actually deal with this city. And I've got uh, enemy on the way. I can still send a bench already. I think. Let's, uh, because these are just a bit better than others. We're going to send three units on the way. We're going to add them to deal with the bar. And then we'll join with other troops uh, next to Yan. I think it might be the best to do. Uh, Chengdu, we've got uh, barely enough units. Nah, it's not going to happen. I cannot really uh, remove too many units from Chengdu because, you know, we've got cities which are filled with... Uh, okay, cannot take this one, there is only bombs. And um, yes, we'll see. All right, they've got more trouble in the Chui. Hopefully, it will be done soon because uh, the force of the zoo are going to uh, get weaker and weaker. Plus, they are very far from their town, I believe. So, it might take some time to bring reinforcement for them. Okay, are they bailing? It's definitely possible. All right. So no more battle for now. Okay. Uh, I might want to try to make uh, peace with the zoo. Well, I will see that next time. Bandits, where? Uh, okay. These units, these are not mine, are they? Oh, it might. No, no, my units are over there. Three units of bandits. I think I should be able to deal with these. Maybe they're going to attack Jian Jian Zhu. It might be uh, useful. So Yi Cheng, uh, uh, we're going to occupy the settlement. I forgot about this. Peacefully. All right. And um, I cannot do much for now. For two turns. I just check. It seems to be peaceful. Uh, we cannot do uh, much with this either, so we need to wait a bit. Hopefully, are they producing their own food? Eh, uh, not really. There's another city which seems to be uh, very, very good for now. We'll need to expand it a bit. We've got Shrumble in Z. Uh, why, why is that? Suppression is much lower. Uh, I think I might want to uh, recall my units. So it's going to help us to keep the city. Don't want to lose the. Uh, how much trouble do we have here? Oh, food shortage is getting much worse. Mm. Do I have a place where I can actually add more farms without uh, adding more burden? Not this one. Chengdu is kind of fine, but what's going on here with these? Convert farmland. 
Oh, no, it's it's being done. It was just a little bug. Okay. No, not yet, Jen. Come on, buddies. Uh, uh, the... No, not the time. I'm going to remove bunch, even. Uh, Zitong. Not really. Jamming could. Maybe add two more. Mianzu uh, has a bit of margin here as well. Alright. Seika is quite fine, but there is no more uh, land to uh, transform into farms. Okay, we cannot do much more. Anyway, we've been able to take Yi Chang. We uh, managed to keep uh, Yi Chui in the end of our ally, and for now, it seems to be manageable. We'll just need to reclaim a few city and end this war. So guys, I hope you like the episode. If you do, please leave a like, a comment, or subscribe. And I'll see you next time, guys. Have fun!